Good, uh, good evening. It's nothing short of spectacular. The consistency of championship caliber football from the Caledonia program. Since 2005, 10 state appearances, 6 state titles. Warriors, a pair of wins away from their 7th in 12 years. Caledonia heads to U.S. Bank Stadium this Friday to face Barnesville in the Class 2A state semis. Kickoff scheduled for 11.30 a.m. During last season's state title run, defensive end Ezekiel Ott was only a spectator after a season-ending knee injury. The University of North Dakota commit is healthy heading into Friday, and the team leader with 12 sacks couldn't be more excited about the opportunity ahead of him. It's pretty awesome to be out here, and it's not, I wouldn't even say it's personal. It's just great to be out here with everybody else, and it's equally amazing for every senior on the team, every player on the team. It's uh, really special. It's unreal the amount of work he put in to get back to where he was last year, and I think he's even better than he was at last year. And he, I think the biggest difference is now he's able to help all the other D linemen and everything, and just working and letting them know where they need to be on every play and all that. And he's an extremely talented kid. On the offensive side of the football, quarterback Owen King has picked up right where he left off last season. This year he has 39 touchdowns to only four interceptions, nearly 200 passing yards per game. But he's done it with different faces leading the way all around him, like 1,400-yard rusher Ben McCabe and 1,200-yard receiver Andrew Gorgon. Andrew demands a double team uh, coverage-wise, which is great because that leaves uh, Sam and Jordan one-on-one, -on -one, and then Alex's brother one-on-one -on -one for the most part, and then Ben, yeah, he's, he's a threat to score. He's a home run hitter as a running back, and he can throw it to him out of the backfield too, which is nice. 